Hi guys, I'm Raffaello Bongi and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we will speak about the new Jetson Nano 2 Giga. This is the new version of the NVIDIA Jetson for the Jetson Nano and uh, will be at the price $59. But uh, I would like to suggest you to subscribe to my channel and make a like on uh, this video. And for a complete review, uh, I suggest to go on my website rnx.it where you will see my complete review on my new Jetson Nano 2 Giga. For uh, the link you can see on my description and uh, you can read uh, directly there uh, what you need or other information about this new Jetson Nano 2 Giga. And now let's go for this unboxing because honestly I'm really curious to know how oh, it's work this new Jetson Nano. The new Jetson Nano 2 Giga have the same uh, box of the previous Jetson Nano. We can see the difference that is right 2 Giga and I noticed I mean, while I was looking at uh, this uh, uh, this box uh, is change the message written here on this side I am AI and uh, the information more or less uh, are uh, the same in fact uh, if, if uh, I can take the previous Jetson Nano kit uh, we can see more or less the size is equivalent uh, but we notice something really important there is a different carrier but uh, I will speak in detail later uh, after that, okay, I can literally start to open, I don't know, but if you see, this label is really new, and now I want to open and see what there is inside. Okay. Uh, okay I love unboxing these packages, and now, ready for the revolution. Wow, 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 wow. The box is more or less the same. We can see this is the board. What we have inside here, ah, this new box, this new element. Yes, we can see what, or we can connect the Jetson. The micro CD is needed, it's important to pick up this uh, micro CD uh, card to use for our Jetson Nano 2 Giga. And, 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 yes, safety information. This is Japanese, I, I think, or Chinese. I want uh, they learn this language. I love these countries. And, 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 that's all, that's all. I want really see what we have inside. Okay, okay, let's go, let's go, open, open this box. And finally, we have here the new Jetson Nano 2 Giga. Compare the previous version, yes, I can see the new carrier. The new carrier, I really can notice, is completely different compared to the previous Jetson Nano. Uh, version 4 giga. In the beginning we can see a USB-C connector, three USB uh, port, we miss one, means uh, this USB-C port to power and to control the Jetson is the same. We have one HDMI, is not included a DVI connector. We have the same Ethernet port, one micro USB, a Raspberry Pi connector, only one uh, camera connector and 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 more or less uh, is the same in fact if i take now the jetson nano this is the first version with one hdmi uh, with sorry with one uh, camera connector we can see this difference overall overall uh, this is the same size same story if you have a Jetson Xavier NX, the size is always the same, we can compare the size, 
and 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 is important if you want to work with a Jetson Nano 2 Giga you can change the carrier if you have an example a Jetson Nano and you want change or use another one you can unplug the Jetson Nano core move in another uh, carrier but you can't move on a Xavier NX. This is important. You can not, not use this carrier board for your Jetson Nano 2 Giga. But this is example is really good if you have a 4 uh, Giga version, but uh, you prefer to work with a USB-C uh, power plug, you can switch the model. Okay, okay, this is the information about the carrier. Now I won't see how it's working in action because uh, I don't want to only see <laughs> on my desk. And now let's go to see how it's work. We can see now when I plug the USB-C port on my uh, power reader, the power is less than one watt and for a few seconds is more than 5 watt. This is because the board is starting up and more devices are connected, example my dongle, the keyboard and the HDMI. Anyway, uh, after the boot the average of the power is 3 watt or less because the NVP model is uh, max N. Thanks for watching, see you in my next video, bye!